me a little bit about your February course that you're going to teach. Uh, your, your, English as a second language for Canadians? Yes. Can you talk a little bit about that? Because I, 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 I'm going to try to take that if I can, even well, though I believe English is my first language, but uh, yes, I know. not adequate enough. Um, well, that's it, you see. Um, I, I, want, I want to expand people's uh, understanding of the words we use and extend, ex expand their vocabulary um, to make them more clear, more sure about the way they construct their sentences and uh, so that they can, they can utter what they have to utter with greater confidence and variety, a much broader command of the language that is supposedly theirs. And, uh, and to know, you know, for instance, yeah, if we're talking about, about pronouns. A pronoun is a word that stands in place of a noun. And we have the, 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 the personal pronouns. I, you, she, he, it, they. But that's in the nominative case. Then we can, we have the possessional, possessive pronouns, his, your, yours, theirs, and that changes things. That changes the way you construct what follows after that. Uh, and that begins to get you subtly, ever so subtly, into subordination. Uh, a sentence, an utterance that stands completely on its own and another utterance that is dependent on another one in order to make sense. And these things, uh, they come naturally, gradually. And I have a series of uh, test questions, which, uh, you know, in, in a, a class, you'd write out the answers. Well, we'll look at the, at the, at the questions and we'll go one by the one and try, try, try this one, try this one, try this one. And it's fun. The whole point is it's fun to learn this stuff. It's not a chore. It's not a, a school mom saying da 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 da. No, it's the joy, the release, it's constant as we get further and, and you are speaking with greater confidence with greater variety uh, and with with subtler persuasion you're making your points ever so much more richly and easily <laughs> 